Hey, what's up everyone? It's Steph from Steph Lee Films. Today is such an exciting day for all A10 Mini or A10 Mini Pro users. Blackmagic Design has just released an update a couple of hours ago. They just raised their already so high bar again. Before I continue, just go to this link, go download the latest A10 software 8.2.3 and while you're downloading the update, come back to this video and watch me rave about this update. Remember this video that I shot two weeks ago which I talked about how to fix that audio delay on your A10 Mini Pro? If you have watched it, thank you very much for your support. If not, forget it, don't waste your time because Blackmagic Design has listened. Okay, just kidding. Do spend some time to watch it because it could help in some way as I talk about the fundamentals to having a smooth live stream. You know what I love about companies who actually listen to their real users and make changes or updates to their software or equipment to cater to these real people out there? In my last video, I talked about the 5 ways to fix the audio delay and the last tip was to purchase an audio sync corrector to fix the problem. That equipment itself costs 80 to 100 bucks minimum. And I know that some of you have commented that tips 1 to 4 won't work, but let me address those concerns first. Tips 1 to 4 are your basic fundamentals. I won't assume that everyone is tech savvy. But having a solid foundation, which includes stable internet connection, fast upload speed, shooting in the correct resolution, etc., are indeed factors which may cause problems during your live stream and an audio video delay could be one of those problems. Again, I'm not saying that those tips will definitely solve your problems, but these factors could possibly cause audio delays on your live stream if they're not properly taken care of. Okay, so back to today's video. Blackmagic Design has just officially released a software update 8.2.3, and what it says here is this software update adds the ability for the user to select up to eight frames of audio delay on analog microphone inputs of the A10 Mini models. I believe a lot of streamers use the OBS Studio software where there is an option to dial in an audio delay but we did not see it on the A10 Mini software control. But now they have added this function in the latest update today. So great news for all A10 users from now on. Certain points to note regarding system requirements for Mac OS and Windows during download, so do take note. After you have installed the update, you need to update the switcher or console as I like to call it as well. Basically just connecting the switcher to your computer via the Ethernet cable and wait for the prompt. Click OK and proceed and you should be good to go. Now for a little bit of photo hunt fun, comparing before and after. Did you manage to find out where they hide this new little guy? It's here in the audio tab under your mics 1 and 2 under the decibel level. There's a new arrow icon here pointing to a 0. Click on it and a mic input settings window pops up where you can turn the knob to dial in the appropriate delay. So there you have it. Today's video is just a short one just to quickly update you guys on the latest software update from Blackmagic Design today which I think should really get many of you excited. Although it has taken some time, but as the saying goes, better late than never. And it shows that these guys do care about us users. Tell your friends about this and share the information just like how a friend shared this information with me. Before I end this video, I'd like to say that it really means a lot to me if you found this information useful and if you can give this video a like and share it with your friends so it encourages me to continue making such videos for you. If you want to learn more about photography and videography on this channel or hear about the latest breaking news on technology like this episode, don't forget to subscribe and click on the notification bell. And as always, if you have any questions, please let me know.